Uh, well, we have a lot of new faces that probably contribute to that. Uh, we've got some guys who played a, a good bit of minutes. Um, we're bringing experience back, so that combination it hopefully leads to a lot of wins. What is it like now looking around at practice? Uh, at the talent? Yeah, I mean, we got a lot more talent. We got a lot more depth, which all of us are excited about. And, you know, I think the big thing is that we like playing with each other. And Coach brought in a bunch of good guys who, uh, who want to win. And um, we're all on the same page. The, uh, the big emphasis, I guess, was um, rim protection, physicality in the paint, those kind of things. How, how do you guys improve in that aspect? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, Cavell's going to bring a, a, a lot of rebounding and uh, shot blocking. And uh, Nas, is, uh, Nas brings size. Darius is really good. Emmett's really good at rebounding. So uh, we've got some guys who are going to do a great job on the glass this year. Coach said you've been working on your shooting. Yeah. Uh, you've been working on getting bigger. Yeah. I mean, what, what's the offseason been like for you so far? Uh, I, it's been a lot of uh, a lot of it's actually been you know learn how to become a better leader, and um, you know learn how to talk more, and uh, just you know being here being a vet now, uh, just trying to be uh, an extension of coach. We've we've talked so much about the. Um, Freshman class and the new players, but you know, Coach made an effort to point out that you and uh, Mays and uh, not Mays uh, Sims, you are Mays. Uh, <laughs> you know the veterans coming back. Yeah. Um, that you guys are really important to this team. I mean, what role do you think you guys are taking in that regard? Oh uh, yeah, I think uh, you know experience uh, brings a lot. Um, you kind of know what you're in for. You kind of like these guys. They they have they ooze talent, but uh, they just they just don't know too much yet. Uh, and they haven't gotten their feet wet yet. And um, I think just us knowing that kind of what we're in for uh, gives us maybe an edge, but also, you know, we're able to help them and uh, get things moving faster. These high expectations are kind of unfamiliar territory for this program. Yeah. I mean, how are the new guys and the old guys kind of working with that, with the pressure? Uh, I don't think we th uh, thought about it too much, to be honest. But it's kind of been a day to day grind. We've been so tired from, you know, practice and all that stuff, so we haven't really thought about the season. Uh, we haven't thought about Southeastern or any of that, but you know, we're just worried about getting better every day. Is it weird for you now that you're a junior? I mean, I remember whenever you were a freshman. Yeah. Uh, being yeah. a leader on this team now, I mean, is it, is it kind of weird or is it just uh, kind of Well, I was kind of like, I was the team captain last year, so I, I kind of understand that leadership role, but I think I'm getting better at it as the years go on. I feel old, I just turned 21 on the fifth, so. Uh, Starting to get to me a little bit, but I'm good. Coach said on the radio, NIT won't cut it this year. Oh, no, no way. We, we're we not thinking about the season right now, but uh, we definitely don't expect to be in the NIT. Do you spend any time thinking about sold out crowds, being ranked in the top 25, that kind of excitement? Yeah, I, I mean, I expect it. I know we've put the work in to deserve that. Um, you know, obviously it's got to translate to wins. But, um, you know, with the group that we have, I like our chances. Have you noticed any difference in Coach Wade in year two as opposed to year one? Mm, nah. He's always, I mean, he's always had that attention to detail. He's always been hard on us. Uh, you know, he expects a lot out of us, probably more than we expect out of ourselves. And, uh, you know, he coaches us that way. Does he keep you guys uncomfortable, meaning in a good yes, way? Yes, yes, in a good way. In a good way, we can never be complacent under him. Uh, we watch a lot of film on ourselves. Uh, we hardly hear that we have a good practice. Uh, but uh, yeah, he's big on uh, getting better. He's actually helped me. Uh, and, uh, he gave me a book talking about the growth mindset. And um, just the basis of it is not being complacent. So that's something that he's big on and he tries to make sure that rubs off on all of us. Because Coach Wade, he says he puts a lot of trust in you. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. knowing that he thinks of you that way, does it, does it uh, you know, compliment you? What do you think about it? Oh, yeah. Well, I think I, uh, I try my best to carry myself the right way and uh, put on the right image uh, among my teammates and to the public. So, um, you know, I'm happy that he feels that way. And, you know, I, I plan to keep this trust. So, Like I saw him during the summer. 
And I said, okay, you're finally done with recruiting, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he said, yeah. if I can go get two guys that are better than two guys on that team right now, yeah. I'll do it. Yeah, I mean, I, that can kind of go back to him one never getting complacent, I guess. Yeah.